Guys, we are finally strong enough to actually two-turn auto this bad boy. Hi, welcome back to another Princess Connect video. My name is Lace, and today we're going to be talking about how to clear this very, very hard. Okay, well, he's just very hard. I'm pretty sure there's going to be a very, very hard, but this guy today is very hard. But to be honest, he's not actually very hard. And you know what? Forget it. Let's just get into the video. And so we've got this armor guy. He's called the Living Male. But essentially, what we are going to do is like, I'm going to show you a couple of different comps that you can hopefully use to clear this boy. And seeing as this is the Jun event, if you guys still haven't started started playing like start playing now because this is probably like one of the best times but not only that for you Junless people you can finally have Jun and like so hopefully you're gonna have the Jun and Makoto the shredder combo you know what I'm saying but yeah I'm gonna stop stalling and before we actually give it a shot so I might give like the one turn kill a shot like I'm actually gonna go and show you some of the resources that I will be uh well hopefully sharing with you guys I don't need to hope to share I am gonna share it with you guys just give me one hot second all right guys and so welcome to the ironclad vh2 turn no Makoto full auto so this one is a real mouth but this is really really good because I completely respect that a lot of people do not have the Makoto however there are so many ways to actually do a two turn full auto on this guy we've actually gotten to the point where we have so many ranks and so many levels that we can comfortably two turn the VH boss on full auto and so here is the first comp by bad anxiety oh, sorry sorry it's actually just bad anxiety and what he's showing us is a very very cookie cutter like kind of CB like build and so we've got the Jun we've got the Kao we've got Tamaki we've got Samakokoro and Mitsuki the beautiful thing about this comp and to be honest honest like a lot of comps now is that like we actually have so much physical defense down and so you can see that you don't even have to have Makoto right we have the Jun we have this S Kokoro and we have the Mitsuki and so we have three sources of defense down in Jun Mitsuki and S Kokoro but we also have the heal if you guys do want to make upgrades to this I would probably replace Mitsuki with Makoto and I would say like summer Tamaki for Tamaki Tamaki as always is very important to your survivability because she is constantly stealing the TP from the boss however I'm not going to talk too much more about this I'm just going to show you guys the comp because there are quite quite a few comps in case you guys don't have everybody here. I know a lot of people still do not have the Jun. However, again, like after this event, that should not be an issue anymore. All right, so moving on, let's have a look down in the comments. And so the first comment is actually the Jun and this S Kokoro for this person was three stars and it still worked out. And to be honest, like if you find your units dying or whatever, like you should be able to just manual it a little bit, like time some of the spells or some of the UBs to actually like get some optimal healing. Because again, we are way past the stat check for like a two turn auto for this guy. And I hope you guys remember from the first time we encountered a VH boss, I told you guys it only gets easier. Anyway, moving on. So we've got that guy over here. However, this was an interesting one. And the reason it's interesting is because it's actually a full auto, no Jun, no Makoto in two turns. So we've got the Maho, Mitsuki, S Kokoro, Kaori, and Miyako. And I think this is really, really good because we've got the extra survivability from Maho. However, what this guy is proving is that Mitsuki and S Kokoro, both of which are characters that are kind of like free to play. Well, I guess all characters are free to play, but they are a lot easier to obtain than like like your Jun and your Makoto. This guy was actually able to pull it off with this comp and so he has attached a Billy Billy video here and so thank you to Taeson. However, because this comp is only using Mitsuki and S Kokoro, I would say that there's probably like a level requirement. And the reason I say that is because like you've got your defense shred actually scaling with levels and so like, well, he's max level. But if you're not max level and you're using your Mitsuki and your S Kokoro only, then like you might actually not have enough of like the defense down to be able to take him down in two turns. But yeah, guys, as always, just align with the stars. But like, this is really, really good to see that like we actually can do some comps without Jun and Makoto. And so guys, the next comp that I want to show you guys is this one over here. So I believe it's actually like a JP person. So this boy here. And essentially it's a very, very similar idea. However, we are getting less and less defense down. But I do want to show you guys like where we finish on the first of the comp, right? And what he's showing off right now is probably just like replacement. So you can see like he did the Tamaki to the S Tamaki replacement. Generally the same because I think they steal the same amount of TP. However, the S Tamaki does more damage. And so if you guys do have her use her. All right, moving on. Let's have a look at where this boss ends up. So you can see that he's actually made it to 380k out of 11 mil, no 1.1 million. That's really good. That's really good. And the reason that's so good is because he has shown that he was able to take probably about like 65% off the boss in one turn. And so I would have no doubt that you would actually be able to take down this like boss from this HP with a similar comp for your second turn. All right, moving on. Like to be honest, this thread is full of bright ideas. Miyako, Kari, Nozomi, Makoto, S. Tamaki. There are honestly like so many good comps. So I'm just going to link this and drop it in the comments below. However, the one I do want to show you guys, the one that I want to try is this boy over here. So you guys already know your boy, Wee Wee 
WeWeChu. WeWeChu is like really big on the translations from CN, bringing over a lot of guides for us. And so as always, massive shout out to WeWeChu. And so this is for us sweatier nerds like me. And so like, uh, honestly, I don't know if I can be bothered anymore, but I will try it. I will try it. And so like, so we've got like three comps here. We've got like Jun, Kari, Nozomi, Makoto, and Arisa. However, what I do want to say about this comp is that it is actually really RNG reliant. I have actually run this one a few times and I can't actually make it. My reason personally is that my Arisa is actually only three stars. And so I don't really have the necessary damage to take him down. However, moving on. So this is probably the one that I'm going to be trying next. So we've got the uh, Miyako, we've got the Jun, Kari, Makoto, and Saren. Very, very similar to the CB comp. You guys already know what it is. I can already see it. Remove the Miyako, put a like Shiori on the end, and you've got the Jun Saren comp. However, the interesting about this is that we need additional 50k damage from crits for the four star Makoto. And so like, again, it is really, really crit reliant, but that's okay for you guys who want to fish for it. Like this is here, but we do have one last comp and this is actually really, really interesting. And the interesting thing is that like it is featuring a five star Akino as well as a five star Samatamaki. Unfortunately for me personally, I do not have Akino. And so like it is, uh, well, it's really sad that I can't even give this one a shot. And so I completely get how you guys without Jun and Makoto feel. I don't have Akino this time. And so again, maybe I'll give the first one a shot again, but I'm probably going to try this one over here. And if you guys do want like the video demonstrations, they are down here. So we, we as always, he's linking all of the sources that he came with. But yeah, there's not much else in the thread. And to be honest, I am so tired of reading. So let's just jump into it. Okay. All right, boys, here we are. Very hard boss, living male. Let's get into it. So what was the comp again? It was la di da di da that and probably Saren. Yeah, it's like the Jun Saren comp, but with a Miyako instead. Okay, so let's try out this timeline. I'm actually pretty eager to actually give this one a shot because like the first one just really, really didn't work. However, at this point, I do want to remind you guys again that like two turns is not bad. Two turns, if anything, is really, really freaking good. And to be honest, guys, I'm probably going to be two turn autoing like the boss like from here on out. I just cannot be bothered. Like it's just like way too much effort for way too little gain. But alas, I must sweat a little bit for you boys. And so let's get this going. Uh, so we are going down to 113 first for the Makoto Yubi after normal attack. Okay, so ooh, why is it going a little bit fast? So she's going to normal attack. Okay, bam. And then UB. So what the frick? That's pretty thick. All right. And after that, we have the 109, 106 after Makoto. Hal. Yep. Bam. Oh, baby, 43k. That's what I'm talking about. So guys, your calories should always be hitting 43ks. That's at least. So like with all of the defense down, you should be hitting 43k. All right, guys, next at 059, we are going to have uh, Jun and Makoto you being. All right, so 059. So there we go. Uh, auto attack. Yep. And then Jun you be. All right. And then 055, we've got Kari coming in with the UB as well. And if we are unable to UB, then we need to wait till 048. So that was 055 as the point. Okay. Let's see. Oh, okay. Well, I didn't make it. I didn't make it. So we are waiting till 048. Let's see if this is still going to work out. So at 048, we're probably... Whoa, wait a second. What the frick? Okay. That was pretty lit, to be honest. That was pretty freaking cool. There's probably a... Oh, okay. Bam. 32 wait a second 32k <laughs> my car is getting a little bit low i don't know if this is how it's supposed to turn out so oh wait actually it says that kari might actually die here from the boss's skill okay i mean if this is all according to plan then such is life so we've got 045 and this is this boy over here uh i'm okay it's 044 i know a little bit late and then we've got a 3432 on miyako asap ub okay so we're at 40 and then so we're doing this guy and then 29 kari Come on. Wait, my car is still alive. Hold up. Come on. Okay. This is uh, 34, 32. Wait a second. Wait, I am way past the... Wait, wait, this is going so wrong. Holy crap. <laughs> what the frick? Uh, okay. You know what? I'll take it. I'll freaking take it. So 14, uh, we're at 30 seconds. So we've got 20 seconds. Uh, no, sorry. 27 seconds Makoto coming up. There is a note to Yubi before the boss Yubi. So we are going 27 Okay, there we go. So the boss is about to UB. I saw it and I was like, frick, screw that shit. And then so after that, we have a Jun and Saren UB at 24 ASAP. Okay, so that's now. Okay, yep. Oh, okay, wait, this is the UB. Oh, and there goes that gal. Oh, baby, okay. Wait a second, we are so far off. I actually don't know if we can finish this off. Wait, and the timeline says that Kari should have survived. Okay, 
Um, it might be a reset for me. To be honest, guys, I'm pretty happy with this. I am just gonna run like a two turn order. I just really cannot be stuffed anymore because in my opinion, the gain is just truly not that massive between a two and a one turn, especially for the hassle that actually like is required for a one turn. And so I'm just gonna actually let this one go through. So yeah, and then just two turn it. That is, it is what it, wait a second no i want to try those auto comps and so guys we are back and i'm going to try out that auto comp uh with the jun and the summer kokoro so i'm going to try that triple one this one is really cool i do i really want to see it uh this one and then we've got the i think tamaki we've got the kari and we've got the summer kokoro where are you okay over here so we're going to run this on auto and hopefully we can do this in two turns uh begin battle please just work please just work Oh man, guys, as you can tell, I've gotten really casual. I'm kind of in like retirement stage for pre-con. Why is this showing me this again? Okay, what are you waiting for? The battlefield calls. No, I'm not a role player. I don't do this kind of things. Uh, <laughs> come on, guys. Let me in. Okay, 122. Uh, that field is going to disappear before the Kari is going to be able to. Okay, you know what? It's order. It's order. I can't, I can't do this. I can't just be like, I want to intervene because I'm, I'm not allowed to intervene okay so hopefully this is going to get us like to past 60 percent or to about 60 percent so we can then actually like go on to finish him off 45 seconds he's gotten they've gotten up to there i reckon they'll make it i reckon it'll be fine so yep we got a 21k oh god wait a second this joint what the f hello how is this how is this supposed to work Wait, is, is this really order? Um, okay. I am very scared. You know what? I'm going to commit, guys. I'm going to commit to this. I didn't even hit halfway. Holy crap. Wait a second. I didn't even hit halfway. As you can see, we have 47% over here. Um, okay. I don't think I'm actually going to get the two-turn order, but like, let's give it a shot. And if I don't get it, I am definitely going to be restarting because I am not going for three turns. Like, it's two turns at the very least for me. Or at the most for me, I guess. Okay, okay, wait a second. Why, what the frick? Why did I get wrecked so hard? Did I get, did I get critted or something? Um, there was some TP suckage there. 106, 105. Okay, maybe it's actually easier in, uh, in rage mode. Wow, wait, actually, wait. The Tamaki actually did so much damage. Mm. Are we gonna make it? I think we're gonna die. I, I really think that we are gonna die here. Maybe not. Maybe, oh my god, we are so dead. This is not going to work. This is not going to work, guys. We are aborting mission here. Holy crap. What the frick? Guys, the post said no more Koto two-tone auto. Twice now, my DPSs have died. No, I'm not blaming the guy. There's probably some crits in there or something. And so, like, I'm just going to reset this and hopefully, like, chuck in somebody and make it work a bit better. Guys, I really shouldn't have committed to that first one, especially because I knew it was going to end at, like, 50%. So, I think I got to be a little bit smarter for this one. Mm, maybe I can run the same comp. Maybe, or maybe I will just use, like, uh, Makoto instead and then I will just, like, adjust. All right, let's just try this. And then, so, I'll just, like, hit the Kari Yubis on the defense downs. And having that heal is going to be really, really handy. So, I'm going to not auto. And uh, let's see. So, we've got uh, Makoto's on and then we've got Jun's on. So, I'm probably going to hold this for Makoto's. Yep. And then I'm going to hit this one. Yep. This should be like 43. Oh my baby. <gasps> Woo. Okay, cool. That is um that is it, guys. Oh. Why is my Makoto dying? Holy. Why is my Makoto like pretty much dead? Hello? Okay. Okay. Um I'm, I'm going to wait for Makoto. Yep. And then I'm going to hit this one. Yep. Oh. 50k. That's what I'm talking about, baby. All right. Uh but everyone is dying. Oh, shit. God. Okay. We've got 111 left. Can we actually do this? Wait, we have no UBs left. Wait. <laughs> wait. Wait, this isn't going to work. Wait, wait, wait. Why did I think this was going to work? This guy steals TP. And so the healing from my, like, Kokoro is not going to actually be reaching, like, my units. Okay, I'm going to have to adjust even more here. So I'm going to replace my Kokoro with, like, somebody else that actually heals on skill rather than on UB. All right, lads. I am back. I think this is the move. I hope the Maho is enough to actually keep my units alive. Maybe, hopefully. If not, I'm probably going to try running, um, not a Misato, maybe a Yukari. But yeah, now I've actually dug myself into a hole. And I don't know if I can get out of it because like i didn't even make 50 percent oh dear 
Oh dear. Okay. Okay. Come on. So first we're going to get the Makoto Yubi off and then we're going to get the Kara Yubi off. So auto attack. Uh, I mean, not auto attack. That first. And then why is Kari lagging so hard? Okay. Punch. Got this one going in. Holy crap. That's a second crit. That's so good. What the frick? Okay, I just need to make sure. Oh my god. Okay, the Makoto got clutch healed. But I need the Kari to get healed or else she really is going to die. All right, midline. We're just going to go for another. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys. You know what? Oh, oh no, 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 no. Jun's gonna die. My Jun is gonna die. Oh no, she didn't die. She didn't die. Holy moly. Okay, okay. I think I'm actually gonna be okay here. I think I'm actually gonna be okay. So, Makoto, hard slash, cancel. We're gonna go into a Kari UB, midline thrust, cancel. And 44k. And I think we've got this in the bag. I'm gonna, I'm gonna UB ASAP because like he's about to actually take off some of my TP. And we've got 4.4k. And this is it. Holy crap. <laughs> What the heck? This was, um, this was really, really freaking scary. I really screwed myself there at the start. Like, if you guys do notice that you're not going to pass, like, the 50% HP, which you guys should be, then I would really highly recommend resetting and not doing what I did. I had to actually adjust and, like, start thinking for myself. But yeah, I hope that was helpful. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I hope you guys enjoyed my misfortune. And so I guess with that being said, I don't think there's anything left to share with you guys. And so let's start wrapping up this video. I got a secret message for you guys, and that is adjust. Because without my sharp wits and quick thinking, I would have been screwed over and honestly it wasn't that fast i was like a little bit like Kepega. a little bit slow i should have like known that the summer coco wasn't going to be getting her ubs off but it's okay we made it in the end i'm just kidding i am so small brain like i can't believe i let that first hit go through but anyway if you guys could drop that secret message down in the comments below i would really appreciate it because it means you've actually watched up until the end of the video and so thank you guys so much but otherwise please consider a like a sub a comment a follow you guys already know what it is and if you guys would like to support the channel we do have a couple of ways down in the description below we've got affiliate links and we've also got the membership program thing and I've got a story here. But as Jun once said, all good things must come to an end. And so thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.